It's getting pretty close, isn't it, sweetheart? It seems like not that long ago we were demoing trim for the very first time in the downstairs, what was a dining room, and now we're painting trim in the upstairs. Just wanted to let you know that I couldn't have done any of this without your support and your help and your guidance. I love you so much. Rainy days don't seem so wet Stormy nights don't stay From the moment that we met You're worth the wait Oh, this could be the best thing that I'll ever know Talk for hours and never slept Two silhouettes on the concrete steps We watched the sun as it slowly crept From the horizon to the place we met Oh, this could be the best thing that I'll ever know Hi everybody, welcome back to the stone house. If you're new to the channel, my wife and I, we bought this really old stone house. We've been renovating it pretty much just on weekends for over four years. As you can see, we're getting close in some areas. We still have quite a bit of work to do downstairs and we have a whole another side of the house that's gonna be our kitchen, master bedroom, master bathroom, little dining area. That's still to come. But if you're interested in this sort of thing, maybe think about hitting the, uh, what? This week, molding. Last week you saw I made a whole bunch of molding with Sarah. This week we're gonna be installing it. And I'm gonna start, I'm gonna start right here on Lily's closet door. Pretty easy, there is some stuff I need to prep. There's the, Oh, what's this thing called? Oh, if you're also new, I'm not a professional. I, I don't really know what things are really... So, this this piece of wood sticks out here. I need to cut that off flush. So, I need to do that first. And then we're going to be getting some casing up here. Casing around. I'll just do it. I'll just do it. And then you can watch me. Let's just do that. Where have all the good men gone? The ones that held in their arms Justice for all mankind And listen till they heard both sides Is this reality? We can't define what makes us care to breathe But if I ruled the world I'd sail the seas Looking for someone To tell me what it means To love without taking Old with gentle ease Stay where you can't see what's really beneath If I ruled the world If I ruled the world Hide me where the bodies lie Are gathered over time of saints who tried to reason why, but the world. 
world prefers a darkened sky Oh, to be naive To think we live just to die in peace But if I ruled the world I'd sail the seas Looking for someone To tell me what it means To love without taking Old with gentle ease Stay where you can't see what's really beneath If I ruled the world If I ruled the world Oh, find me on the other side I'll be trying better at everything I have ever tried and failed to be I wear every let down I show every scar and I found that hope can only carry you so far so won't you touch this heart Yeah, the, uh, this all had to be put at an angle here. Now, if we wanted to, we could probably fill this, but I just think uh, it's okay. I wasn't going to try to cut, like, whatever weird, it would have been like a triangle, like a cut, cut, cut. Oh, geez, yeah. I'll be okay. It looks great. Look how awesome that looks. Daddy needs a high five from you. Thanks, Dad. <laughs> Um, so I guess I could do her door. <laughs> These doors are humongous. Can't get over how lucky we were to get those. What would we have done? We would have just put in all random farmhouse doors, right? Well, we would have had to try to find like matching doors or just have all different doors? Probably all different. Oh. I mean, that's fine, whatever, but I'm very happy that we don't have to do that. I'm going to have to cut this little piece of wood. It's going to be loud for a second. Oh, 
You can't do that, it's a little too long. Does this look okay right here? Yes. Yes? Okay. I gotta cut this piece. Go in there and plug your ears. No one ever made a difference by being like everyone else. P.T. Barnum. Oh, that's from Greatest Showman. Cool. That would be on your door. Do you want this one on the right or the left? Yeah. Left? Yeah. So this one is just a picture of all Lily, Jason, you. Want me to show the camera? And Lily drew this for you? No, Mommy did. Oh, Mommy drew this? Okay. <laughs> we better put Mommy's name on it. Sarah. Age? 37. You want to go out there? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, okay, you can go out. You like that? Okay, go ahead. Bye. I'll show you when the door's done. Leaving the old life behind. Giving the new one a try. Making the past as we go. Trying. Finding a new way to define The way our life is in this time Changing familiar thoughts as we go Shaping the world that we show Rocking and rolling. I only got one more door to do. A half a door too. This one, perfect on the right hand side. Left hand side had a huge gap, but I filled it. And once that's painted, you'll never know. Don't tell anybody. That's the last door and I'm just gonna do it. And I'll show you when I'm done. Uh, this one was pretty interesting and it's really dark so I, I can't really show you. But there were some quirky things that I had to do, and I do have a pretty good sized gap way up here in the top left, but you're never going to notice that. I didn't put anything on the left hand side, I honestly don't even know, like, maybe once I get the baseboard in there, I'll be able to just put like a little tiny piece of something back there. Otherwise, it honestly can probably just be caulked and painted. Pretty interesting how... A lot of these doors turned out coming into the slant and just kind of made it a lot more difficult than it needed to be. But then for those of you that have been following for a long time, you know that this was like the only place to put the hallway and like a, a bathroom up here in the upstairs. It really was the only way to do it. And a lot of engineering and changing went on to make this all happen. There were walls and beams and and in the end, I'm not terribly short, but I'm not tall either. I mean, there's only, it's like six foot five right here. But a lot of times when you're coming in to go to the bathroom, you're here. So it feels crunchy. It, it feels tight. Uh, but the, uh, oh, what's it? What, like the give and the take, you know, like. This is awkward, but because it's awkward, we're able to have a bathroom upstairs, which is pretty huge. And uh, once you get used to it, it's not that bad. So yeah, no, not bad at all. That's all I'm gonna do for today. I did what? Closet door, I finished Lily's door, I did the inside of Elspeth's door and her closet door. And then I did the bathroom door. That's pretty good. And it's early. It's early in the afternoon yet. 
but we're gonna we're gonna go do some other stuff, have some fun. We've been working on the house every single day this whole week, so let's just mm, let's go do something different. <laughs> Maybe you guys can help me move some of the stuff. Can you get go like that way? Yeah, and then good job. Good job. Good job. So corner blocks. Do you want them everywhere? Like one? There'd be one, two. From Jace's room, I did that one. Three, four, and then that one over there is five. That's it. And then an outside corner, we won't do that there. We'll just do the miters, uh -huh. like I did. So I need five corner blocks. That's fine. Okay. Right here is, is weird. Oh, it's just the fact that the molding doesn't go all the way to the edge here. So I kind of need to have like a little piece here and I have it, I don't know yet really though. But I have plenty of off cuts and I can try, try, try until I get something that I like right here. Try, try, try until you cry. There will uh -huh. be no crying. There's no crying in molding. <laughs> so yeah, molding, I'm gonna get going. I'm gonna make my five corner blocks. We'll get them put into place and then we'll see. It's 10, 1038. We'll see how long the one room takes me. Well, I'm glad that you say that. I just, it's gapped there, you could see, but that's a weird, that's a weird angle. It's like this way and it opens, and then this is different. Uh, I okay. think I got lucky. Yeah. Huh? That looks really good. Got lucky, you worked it out. Well, that's true. I got lucky after 30 minutes of trying. I, I reached my limit, I think, already. I've done like three things. It's two o'clock. We started at 10.30 and I've gotten one, two, three, tech, more than three, but technically three pieces of baseboard done. That's it. And let me show you why. Lily's door here, I, I set it at some weird angles because I wanted the door to look cool. I wanted it to, to be a big closet, but not seem like a big closet when you were like entering the room. I could I could further explain. See how like right here you can't even tell that there's a closet over there. It's just it's angled away. It's it's cool. I really thought a lot about this closet. But what I didn't think about was how hard it was gonna be to do the molding down here. Wow. So this little two foot piece right here, it's it's like two really difficult cuts there and it looks dirty and messy right now because the caulking I was using was 
I don't know, it was brown for some reason at first. So that will be primed and painted and sanded flush and everything, but two very difficult cut. I mean, you can see that's just a fraction of my attempts, but I got it. It will look really good once it's primed. Same with this cut over here. It's, it's, I haven't caulked or anything on this one at all, but it, just the way that it goes around, oh, wow. Difficult. Lots of ways I could have done this easier, but I really wanted it to look good. So I just took my time and man, oh man, oh man, lots of cuts. You know, and what's crazy is that it's behind your door. So I shouldn't have worried that much about it, but I just, I just want to try so hard on every, on every inch. Frustration city. I just can't even believe how long that took. I mean, I know that some of you think that I'm kidding. 100 cuts, right? No, I'll show you. There are, let's count them. One, two, three. <laughs> 17, 18. Maybe it was only 45 cuts or so. I think there are some that I'm missing. There might have been a couple that I chucked out the window. This one? 47. <laughs> Unreal. And this is where I tell people all the time, like, I have no idea what I'm doing. I really don't know what I'm doing. And then, then people say, stop being so hard on yourself. I'm not being hard on myself. I'm just, it's the truth. I don't know what I'm doing. Oops. Lily, look what kind of care I'm putting into the smallest detail. You don't need to. What do you mean? I want your room to be perfect. Is that all glued together good too? Yeah. Like the glue st sticking that fast? Yeah. Wow. It's still a little bit going to break, probably. This one, the extra pieces. It's pretty cool. It is, to figure out how to put them together. Like, oh. Should have just taken a whole bunch of sawdust and glue and just shoved it all in there. Mm, yeah. Let it harden. Because you can carve that. And then mold it, yeah. You can't carve. 